I was born in Farmington, Missouri, and I grew up in Potosi, Missouri. Very small place. I went to Potosi High School. The Trojans. <laughs> I went looking for porn under my dad's bed, and I found a book of the Tower of London, about the Tower of London. And there was this engraving by George Cruikshank in there. I just opened it to the page just perfectly. I've got the book here, actually. And um, I just opened the book right to that one page, and there were like 12 engravings of Lady Jane Grey being beheaded. <laughs> and and I was like, I don't remember how old. I was probably 10, 11. I didn't know what a print was, but, but that was pretty much it. And then that same summer, probably I was by then 13, my, um, my parents took me to Washington, D.C. to um, the National Gallery of Art, and they gave me like 25 bucks to buy any art book I could afford in the uh, the uh, museum shop, but that doesn't buy any art book, really, but it will buy a Dover publication. I bought the complete woodcuts of Albrecht Durer, and that was pretty much it. Um, but I didn't know what printmaking was until I went to school, really. I, I just thought they were cool drawings. I didn't have any comprehension what an engraving was, an etching was, a woodcut, or any of that. But um, And I got into, into undergraduate, and... Uh, and they made me take a printmaking class. I went to Southern Illinois University at Carbondale, and uh, I went there from 90 to 93. Joel Feldman and Herbert Fink. Uh, Herbert Fink was a old uh, art students league guy, and Joel Feldman did these big woodcuts that I thought were really cool and amazing, and he really encouraged me a lot to be myself and do woodcuts and more traditional sort of approach to prints, you know, and which was fine with me because I love Dewar and, and it made sense when it all came into focus for me my junior year. But what I was born to do, that was pretty much it. Well, they made me take this printmaking class and I took it because uh, I had, I guess, it, I had a, um, I had to take an elective class to graduate and I either had to choose between a ceramics class and a printmaking class, and I was like, "Oh, I'll take the printmaking crap." And then I did a, I did an etching, and it was weird. I did an etching first. Most people do a woodcut first, but I did an etching first, and uh, I just remember I pulled that paper off of the plate, and it was like I found what I was born to do. <laughs>